Memento M. Christo Channel Your Daily Prayers Channel Psalms 21 and 22 Morning Prayer Psalms 21 The King shall joy in your strength, O Lord, and in your salvation how greatly shall he rejoice. You have given him his heart, desire, and have not withheld the request of his lips. Selah For you prevent him with the blessings of goodness, you set a crown of pure gold on his head. He asked life of you, and you gave it him, even length of days for ever and ever. His glory is great in your salvation, honor and majesty have you laid on him. For you have made him most blessed for ever, you have made him exceeding glad with your countenance. For the king trusts in the Lord, and through the mercy of the Most High he shall not be moved. Your hand shall find out all your enemies, your right hand shall find out those that hate you. You shall make them as a fiery oven in the time of your anger, the Lord shall swallow them up in his wrath, and the fire shall devour them. Their fruit shall you destroy from the earth, and their seed from among the children of men. For they intended evil against you, they imagined a mischievous device, which they are not able to perform. Therefore shall you make them turn their back, when you shall make ready your arrows on your strings against the face of them. Be you exalted, Lord, in your own strength, so will we sing and praise your power. Psalms 22 My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Why are you so far from helping me, and from the words of my roaring? O oh my God, I cry in the daytime, but you hear not, and in the night season, and am not silent. But you are holy, O you that inhabit the praises of Israel. Our fathers trusted in you, they trusted, and you did deliver them. They cried to you, and were delivered, they trusted in you, and were not confounded. But I am a worm, and no man, a reproach of men, and despised of the people. All they that see me laugh me to scorn, they shoot out the lip, they shake the head, saying. He trusted on the Lord that he would deliver him, let him deliver him, seeing he delighted in him. But you are he that took me out of the womb, you did make me hope when I was on my mother's breasts. I was cast on you from the womb, you are my God from my mother's belly. Be not far from me, for trouble is near for there is none to help. Many bulls have compassed me, strong bulls of Bashan have beset me round. They gaped on me with their mouths, as a ravening and a roaring lion. I am poured out like water, and all my bones are out of joint, my heart is like wax, it is melted in the middle of my bowels. My strength is dried up like a potsherd, and my tongue sticks to my jaws, and you have brought me into the dust of death. For dogs have compassed me, the assembly of the wicked have enclosed me, they pierced my hands and my feet. I may tell all my bones, they look and stare on me. They part my garments among them, and cast lots on my clothing. But be not you far from me, O Lord, O my strength, haste you to help me. Deliver my soul from the sword, my darling from the power of the dog. Save me from the lion's mouth, for you have heard me from the horns of the unicorns. I will declare your name to my brothers, in the middle of the congregation will I praise you. You that fear the Lord, praise him, all you the seed of Jacob, glorify him, and fear him, all you the seed of Israel. For he has not despised nor abhorred the affliction of the afflicted, neither has he hid his face from him, but when he cried to him, he heard. My praise shall be of you in the great congregation, I will pay my vows before them that fear him. The meek shall eat and be satisfied, they shall praise the Lord that seek him, your heart shall live forever. All the ends of the world shall remember and turn to the Lord, and all the kindreds of the nations shall worship before you. For the kingdom is the Lord, and he is the governor among the nations. 
All they that be fat on earth shall eat and worship, all they that go down to the dust shall bow before him, and none can keep alive his own soul. A seed shall serve him, it shall be accounted to the Lord for a generation. They shall come, and shall declare his righteousness to a people that shall be born, that he has done this. Subscribe to the channel and leave your like.